Good evening, everybody. I'm Pierre Roberge, The Daily Trader. It is May 28th, and we are going to take a look at Tesla stock. I am not a financial advisor. Please do your own research, make your own decisions. So uh, Tesla closed down a little bit today, uh, down $5.63, down 0.89%. Uh, and post-market, it seems to be down uh, also 0.52%. Let's look at the chart. Uh, so yesterday we had a nice green candle. Um, and today we are having a red candle with a bigger wick on top. So this means that there is a pressure down a little bit. The fact that it's red also means that uh, there was a pressure down during the day. Um, when I look at the low of this candle today, it's, it's still higher than the low of yesterday. So I like to see that. And I also like to see a higher high than uh, yesterday. So basically, it means that it's basically uh, still uh, going up. Let's go to the one hour chart. So where's this morning? 9.30. So uh, 9.30 this morning, so we open here at the top of the uh, rectangle, went up to 6.34, so we went, went up to 6.34, then went down, and then we uh, did not go as down as yesterday, uh, well, as the last candle of yesterday, or the last candles here. So we maintain this uh, position and then uh, built up on it. So green, 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 pretty high. So at 1.30, we, we had a high of 6.32. And, and then we tried to go higher and boom, we got rejected. So basically we have a current resistance at uh, 6.32, a very local resistance that uh, that was uh, acted uh, on uh, during the day. And in the last hour, we fell down a little bit, but look at this. We seem to be, uh, we seem to be touching and maybe I need to adjust some of, I'm gonna adjust this like this. Uh, yeah, this is, this is better. So basically if I adjust it, no, I think I should adjust it to this. Okay. Yeah, it's very important to change them once in a while to be sure that they are right. And then check in the daily chart, the hourly chart. I'm going to do it on the hourly chart. So see, we are touching here, touching here, touching here, touching here and here. So basically, uh, we seem to have broken down a little bit. We seem to have broken down a little bit, but then but then uh, we are still pretty high or higher low than, uh, than what we had at 9.30. Let's go back to the daily chart. So basically uh, we have had a nice run with Tesla. Tesla had a low at, um, at uh, what is at 563 that's that's the close of uh, on May 19th so we had a low there and we've been having this bull trend like look, look at this so one two three four five six seven eight straight days of uh, the stock going up um, so it would not be impossible it would not be impossible that Tesla would be taking a pause a little bit and coming back down to some point. Maybe not down to 561, but uh, maybe just a little pause. So maybe this is what we are starting to see here. Maybe it's a little pause that's happening. Let's look at the uh, stochastic. Uh, stochastic is at 46, so did not quite quite reach uh, 50. Um, MACD is still crossed over as usual and DMI uh, inching a little bit closer. So uh, so uh, this is good. This is good. So um, what should we say about today? I don't think I don't think it's something big. It's just it's just a smaller day, a smaller pause. It's normal for a stock when it's going up 
to have green candles and some red candles. So see, green, green, red, green, red, green, green, red. So it's completely normal. Um, there's this uh, resistance also that I see here at, at 623 and we closed at 625. So there's a resistance at 623 that was used on uh, as support on March 19th, also support on uh, May 10th, you see it? And also, um, also here a couple of uh, days, so December 23rd and also this one, December 8th. So uh, this is a little bump in the road and um, and if we look at this bump in the road, we closed outside of this bump yesterday and we closed also outside today and we just touched it. So um, so seeing this in addition to this, to um, one, two, three, four, five, two, to eight or seven or eight days of uh, bull trend, uh, I don't think there's anything to worry about so far so the stock is just taking a pause in my opinion and we'll see next week what happens if it pulls back a little bit or if it stays uh, put or if it's going to reach if it's going to reach because don't forget we have this uh, resistance here at 655 uh, let's say so so there's still room in there in terms of resistance line to allow the stock to freely go I might express it that way to freely go up to 65. So, uh, so let's hope it does that uh, next week. I'm going to wish you a great weekend. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I produce a video every single day. Thank you for liking, commenting. I read all of your comments. We have a Patreon account. If you like what I do and want to encourage me to do it more and not stopping, not stop doing it. And we have a discount server where you can go and uh, discuss uh, amongst yourselves. So have a great weekend. We are going to talk on Monday and I'm going to tell you à la prochaine.